Jose Luis, you dirty dog. What is up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Sergi Fletcher is the guy that supposedly has his girlfriend been messing around with Jose Luis. But there we go. We're going to dive in. You guys wanted to see this fight. We are going to face off today against Fletcher. We're going to dive in, use this boxing ability. It is a first 10 rounder for us, so let's see how it goes. We're just going to try and box smart. Going to lead with the jab, and uh, we're just going to fight slip. We're just going to, you know, just just pepper him with that jab. Jose Luis's is best weapon, I'd say. His left hand's pretty good, but I'll say his jab is his best weapon. Really evolving into a very smart fighter. Leading with the jab, coming in behind it. He's moving well. We'll just see how it goes, man. Yeah, this dude is not happy. Jose Luis has apparently been sleeping with his girlfriend. And uh, you guys wanted to see this fight. If you check the last video, we got a message saying uh, from our trainer. Oh, from our trainer saying that we've been sleeping with his girl. So, bro, it's just not good, is it? Just trying to pick him off here. Not really looking to lean in and uh, try and... I don't really want to pressure, obviously, it being our first 10 rounder. I want to use our shots wisely. I don't really want to windmill, try and get him out of there early. I'm going to take my time. See him on low standard there. I thought we might be able to rock him. Oh, there we go. Nice double jab. Try to come in behind it. Holding on. Two rocks already this round. Jose Luis starting off very nicely. Head movement on point for this man. Banging the body. There we go. We're making him miss quite a bit too. Nice, ricking the body there. Quick little disclaimer, I am a little bit under the weather, so I do apologise for any bad commentary. Nice. Ripping in. There we go, big shots. Slipping left and right. Fletcher getting eaten alive so far. Been rocked twice. Clean shots from Jose. Nice double jab. Beautiful slipping from Jose. Do you like his new shorts? Let me know down in the comments below. Nice step in with that jab. And again, that jab winning a lot of moments in that fight. In that round, even. There we go. Let's keep going. Round two coming up. Staying calm and composed. Not really looking to freaking dive in there and get the knockout. We're going to just box. We're going to see if it comes, it comes. If it doesn't, I'm more than happy to try and outbox him for 10, you know? I'm not really concerned about the shots that's coming back, though. I'm just trying to wait for a big one. Oh, slip there. Ripping the body. Trying to come back upstairs. Big left hand. Let's keep going. Okay. Nice body shots from Jose. Getting clipped a little bit. Got to watch that. But that jab is really setting up a lot of shots for Jose. So, yeah, I do apologise if I do cough in this video. Anything like that. Beautifully timed straight there. Let's go. Left hands galore. Landed. I don't really want to use too much stamina because this dude has a lot of head health. We're going to let him be. We're going to sit back. The knockout will hopefully present itself later in the fight. What a nice fight so far. Jose Luis fighting a very, very good fight. Beautiful combination. Trying to land a big shot there. Getting clipped a little bit by Fletcher. Nice left. Jose Luis moving very, very well, though. <clears throat> Excuse me. Nice left hand. Moving back in. Staying on him. This is what we want. Stick with that jab. Nice. Let's just land him, though. Let's go. Beautiful head movement from Jose, man. Nice jab. Beautiful left hand. Jose backs up. Fletcher's stamina. Not really in a good place right now. Nice uppercut. Two big shots. Feeling comfortable. As it's a 10 rounder, I was a little bit worried, but. But there you go. I feel like, you know what? It's been two good rounds for us, man. Two really, really good rounds. Remember that straight there. Let's keep going. Moving well. Nice jab to the body. I'd say that's his best weapon, man. His jab. He's making Fletcher miss quite a bit as well. He's kind of punishing him in there. Oh, man, that big leaning in straight. There it is. Trying to come back in with it. Moving well, man. 
I'm having to take a few pauses now and again in commentary just to like swallow and try and sort my throat out, bro. <coughs> Excuse me. I could have had a break and done my videos today, but the show must go on. I must entertain you guys. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful straight there. The boxing ability of you. Uh, you why do I keep saying you guys? Jose Luis is a uh, very, very good man. He's got some nice IQ. He can brawl if he wants to. He's very well rounded. He's got decent punching power. Banging the body there. Trying to come back over with that. I thought he was going to commit and come back in. Let's go. Got to stick the jab there. Nice jab. Banging the body a little bit. Backing up. Beautiful boxing so far in this one. That jab really, really being the means to this winning this fight, man. This jab really, really helping us out. As we see there, nice double jab as we back away. Beautiful boxing. Nice straight there. Let's go. And again. I know that was a jab, but there you go. <laughs> straight is landing. This dude. I feel like Jose is just running rings around him, man. He's definitely landing that jab at will. Rips the body there. That's good. And let's go. <clears throat> God damn. We go again. We go again. 3% recovery. Not great. 75% to 67, though. We're doing okay. 10, 8, 10, 9, 10, 8. There we go. Domination. Should have thrown that, man. I put a lot of stamina into that one, too. Uppercut as he comes in. Beautiful shots there from Louise, man. Starting to open up a little bit more. Nice jab counter. Moving well. So yeah, I kind of wanted a career where we go late all the time. Into like the later rounds. Oh, a big straight there. And I feel like we're going to get it. I mean, some of these guys are going to eventually get done and knocked out. There we go there. And finally, we get the knockdown. We were patient, though. We were very, very patient in that fight. And I'm glad it finally came through and we got the knockdown. He's going to definitely jump straight back up. Our boxing has been so good in this one. Jose Luis has put on a boxing clinic in this fight. He's going to win the fight and he's going to take his girl from him, bro. This is not good. What a fight. Oh, he's opening up. This could be bad. Jose Luis marching forward. Got some very nice accuracy. I think it's because we changed his stance. This, like, it's like an idle stance, the slick start, I believe it's called. I would show you if I wasn't getting punched in the face. But it's got a very nice front jab, I believe. Like, as we see there, and again. The jab definitely wins us this fight, man. 100%. Jose Luis is a jabbing machine. And jabbing is definitely a fundamental in boxing, man. Oh, a big straight drops him. What a perfect punch there. Comes in, hands down. Jose Luis plants one on the chin. Sweet as they come. And Fletcher goes down. Is he going to be able to beat the count? Let's find out. He cannot. Jose Luis gets a fourth round stoppage. A boxing clinic put on tonight, man. And there we go. He runs away with the win and his girl. There we go. Let's get it. Okay, so we're going to get into the next fight, man. Let's rock and roll. Jose Luis takes down another contender in this division. Hopefully, one day, he will break into like the top 10 and get a, tight, uh, get a fight for a title. Get a tight for a fight, I was about to say. That doesn't make sense. It's because I'm ill, man. <coughs> and I need to cough regularly. Okay, so we have Ignatius Stevens. Uh, we have Brett James. Max Castro. We're going to go for this one. Ignatius Stevens. He's an inside fighter. It's definitely going to be a brawl. And uh, we haven't really seen Jose put in that kind of pressure yet. So that's what I want to see. I want to see Jose really, really grinding down and pushed up against. We'll see how it goes, man. Let's get this next fight. Okay, this is a big fight because we're at such a big uh, arena. Metro Manila Arena. We are facing off against Ignatius Stevens, who is an inside fighter. He could pose, he could pose problems for us, man. He could really, really put some problems against Jose. If Jose comes out sharp like he did in the last one, I think we'll be okay. But we'll see. Jose Luis not really got that power. He just brutalizes people. He kind of does remind me a little bit. Only a tiny bit of Lomachenko. The way he sticks that jab, the way he moves around with it. 
Only a tiny little bit, though, man. Lomachenko is in another level of any boxer I've ever seen. Apart from Floyd. I mean, and Muhammad Ali, I guess. There's some other good boxers, man. Like, let me know down in the comments your favourite boxer. I think, dude, that I've got so many. Legit, like, there isn't really many that I like now. Like, I love Canelo. I love Lomachenko. Uh, Triple G. Javonta Davis. He's pretty good. Um... I mean, there's a few. Usyk's pretty cool as well. Um, obviously, Tyson Fury. Deontay Wilder, you know, there's, there's some beasts. Andrew Ruiz and Anthony Joshua as well. They're pretty good. But, yeah, I think, to be honest, I think most of my favorite fighters are retired and they've gone, man. Apart from Manny Pacquiao, we still go, man. That dude will still be going when he's 60. But yeah, I think um, I like... Uh, I don't think who else I actually like. I like, um, what's his face? I've got some really, like, old favourites. I think, like, Roberto Duran. He's, uh, he's up there, man. Duran's one of my favourite. Mike Tyson, just for his pure ferocity. Um, in terms of boxing ability, Floyd Mayweather, man, that dude is a master when it comes to boxing. I like Duran for his, like, savageness as well. That dude just didn't give a fuck. He's a rough, tough dude, man, and one of my favourite. I've got to say. Um, I'm trying to think. It's hard to think about it on the spot. I've literally just mentioned it to get like a conversation going in the comments. And I'd love to see who you guys is like, who your favourite fighter is. For me, I think, uh, I don't know. If we go from weight class, I, I think, I don't know. Marvin Hagler's up there, Tommy Hearns, all of them guys. That, that fight, man. Watch on YouTube. Tommy Hearns, Marvin Hagler. My dad actually told me to watch it, man. And it is an incredible round. They just go at it for like, I think it's round one. And them guys just throw bombs, bro. Legit. They throw complete and utter bombs. This dude. Proving to be quite difficult. He's eating a lot of jabs, though. Big left lands there for Jose. Moving well, nice. This is through with that jab. That's good, man. That's good. He's leaving his hands down low. He's an inside fighter. That's probably a bad idea, man. Gonna get lit up like that. If you're an outside fighter and you're doing it, you could probably get away with it because of the range, but this dude's standing on the inside where you can get hit quite a bit. And you don't want to get hit by Jose too many times, man. He's not a one-punch powerhouse like Bailey Wilson, but he can definitely knock you out, as we've seen in the last one. This is gonna be a tough testing fight, though, but he goes down and eats a shot. I think he was kind of taunting us, and he's like, bro, hit me. And uh, Jose's like, okay, okay, you want to be hit? Let's go, bro. He gets straight back up, though. I didn't expect nothing less. He could go back down, though, man. He is just getting mauled here. He needs to cover up. I'm not complaining if he doesn't, but... He needs to cover up. He needs to get on his bicycle and get out of there, man. Backing him up. Big overhand slams into the face of Stevens. Straight. There we go. This body works. Only round two. Already been down. Predicting another knockout for Jose. He's on a little bit of a knockout streak at the minute. He's on a five fight knockout streak. Pretty decent. He's digging in there. He goes down again. I mean, this dude isn't even defending himself properly. He is swollen up. He is bruised and battered. And that could be a round two stoppage. Is it going to be all she wrote? It is. Jose Luis gets it done again. A big knockout for him. He has just annihilated him. Ignatius Stevens didn't even beat the count, bro. A second round knockout in a big arena as well. For his seventh fight, that's a pretty impressive thing, man. I'm not going to lie. Another win for Jose. Let's keep going in this. Let's keep going. We fought with the Metro Manila Arena with a second round knockout. Jose Luis domination from start to finish again i think it's going to get a lot harder when we fight some actual real fighters like canelo billy joe saunders when we fight like sugar ray robinson like this division is rich it's so so full and here we go anthony mundine ranked 27 i'm taking it we're taking that fight boxer puncher all day long bro let's go we've got a lot of money from that fight so we're still going to go to detroit that is going to be the next fight though mundine let's get in there and try and get an early finish to prove 
that we can be a freaking... I, I just said, literally, I literally just said, like, maybe we shouldn't uh, finish them. Maybe it's going to get a bit harder when uh, we fight these real guys. But I'm going to go for a finish in this next one just to prove and put us on the map that we have fought our first real contender and we stopped him. So let's go. Let's get it. This is the biggest fight of Jose Luis's career, man. This is going to be a tough one. But we're going to get it, man. We're going to go for it. I know this dude's going to bring it. We're just going to pepper him with them jabs, though. That's the game plan. Just hit him with range coming in. He's a little bit taller than Jose, I believe. So he's going to land these shots, but there you go. It is what it is. Nice slip there. Didn't even need to return fire. Jabbing nice. Nice straight there. Oh, he's cut. He's cut already. Mundine is cut. Let's go. Okay. Nice start to the fight. He's cutting in there. He's cut on the eyebrow. This dude's old, man. He's a decent fighter, though. I, I haven't seen too much of Mundine. I know he's got some really good knockouts. I believe. Okay, here we go. Pushing him up against the right. Bang. To the left. Didn't land. Jose really, really working it. Going for the finish, man. Could be a silly thing to do. He's very good defensively, I will say that. Nice three punches land there, though. It slipped through. There we go. Backing up. Nice straight. Straight's a decent weapon for Jose. Bangs him again there. Three punches. Knocks him back. <coughs> God damn. Oh, straight right. Drops Mundine in the first. He is cut to bits, bro. Beautiful shot for Jose Luis. Drops Mundine. He's straight back up, though. Heart of a lion. Let's go again. I want to try and get a first round stoppage. I don't think it's going to happen. 46 seconds left, but... It's quite a bit of a time. Let's, uh, let's see how we can do it. Oh, bro. Not straight there. The jab as well will force him to, like, slip. Then we can usually land some other stuff. He's not really moving much. But it does, though. There we go. Nice. Nice. Ripping them shots. Let's go. Okay, a nice first round. Really, really good first round. He is cut to bits. Knocked down in our favour as well. Trying to land some big shots there as he opens up. Coming in behind that jab quite nicely with the overhands. Got straight lands there. Nice uppercut. There we go. Ripping him with three shots there. He's backing up. The pressure is on through Jose Luis. Let's go. Want to get him up against the ropes so we can go to town. Let's to try and back him up with the jab. There we go. Back him up. Here's where Louise is comfortable. The jab starting to cause some trouble for Mundine, man. It's busted his eye, I believe. Straight. We're really, really aggressive. Just trying to stay on him. Don't want him backing out. There we go. Beautiful shot lands there. I'll just push him up against the ropes. There we go. Holding on. Hell no. Nice shot. Back him up. Trying to push him. Oh, let's go. Overhand, I believe that was. Is that an overhand? It was. Or was it a right hook? I don't know. It's hard to tell from that angle. Let's have a look. It's sort of an overhand. It's sort of an overhand hook kind of thing. But we drop him again. That could be all she wrote. I do think he's going to get up. He's taking his time, which is good. If he takes too much time, he's going to get counted out. He doesn't meet the count. He's been stopped early in the fight as well. Another stoppage for Jose Luis. Let's go. Big, big win against Anthony Mundine, the first real fighter that we've actually fought. So that is very good. And there we go. Domination from start to finish. I'm going to just show you guys who we want to fight next. Let me know down in the comments below. 8-0 with 7 KOs. Got him for the middleweight division at the minute. Who is next, man? I want, I want a real fighter. And, and there's none. Great. Fucking great. So let me know down in the comments who you want to see us face off against out of these guys. Do we give a rematch to Mundine? Do we fight Brett James? 13-5. Max Castro. Let me know down in the comments below. But for this video, guys, I'm going to end it here. Thank you so damn much for watching. If you have enjoyed today's video, smash the like button. Comment and subscribe. And I will see you for more Fight Night Champion next time. <coughs> Jesus Christ. 
Stay awesome, guys. Have an awesome day, and I will see you all again in the next one.